friends, it is January the 14th, and I am on VLCD number five, and had a goose this morning. Uh, I got up at 3.45 to go to the bathroom, and I could never go back to sleep. So I, I kind of waited it out. I waited until about five o'clock. Well, actually I weighed. It's so hard not to. As soon as I get up, the scale's in the bathroom. And so I just, uh, I jumped on and saw the goose. And so I worked for about an hour and a half. And then before I had my first sip of coffee, I jumped back on the scale again and it said the same thing. So whatever, uh, down six pounds in four VLCDs. That's fine. Uh, I've, I've, done better and I've done worse. Um, I'm not going to have any protein powder today. I did make another green smoothie and I didn't put any protein powder in it because I just want to make sure. Um, today for lunch I made this hot damn Mexican soup. God, my mouth was on fire. I, let's see, it was so good. And it really, what did I calculate it at about 225 calories. So normally I don't look at my calories. I'm really bad that way. I just start throwing stuff together and when it tastes good, I eat it. You know, I always figure, I some days I'm over five and other days I'm under five and um, 500. But anyways, I made... I chopped up some jalapeno, about a half of a good size jalapeno. I left out the membranes and the seeds. If I had added that, I wouldn't have been able to eat the soup. Um, I sauteed that with about a half a cup of onion in a little dab of coconut oil. And then I added the Rotel tomatoes, about a, the serving is a half a cup. I think it had diced green chilies in it and let that simmer for a few minutes and then tossed in my four ounce portion of chicken and uh, two cups of chicken broth and a tablespoon of fresh cilantro and then I let that heat up. The chicken was already cooked. It was a chicken breast that I previously cooked. And so heated that up right to the point before it started to boil and then added in some salt and pepper, which I probably didn't need it because the damn soup was so hot, along with another tablespoon of fresh cilantro on the top. And you know, there's just something about soup. It's so satisfying. It fills your stomach up. You know, two cups of liquid is a lot, plus the additional items that were in the soup. And I was very happy with that. Uh, happy enough that I went upstairs and, and tried to calculate the recipe on my fitness pal. Um, you know, ways to reduce the calories would be to cut back on the onions or cut back on the tomatoes. And if you're struggling with stalls, I wouldn't recommend doing tomatoes or onions anyway. And I don't consider myself struggling with the stall. Having a goose after having a six pound loss, um, after loading very lightly, I'm all good. Everything's good. Um, what else? Wait, I've been, <laughs> I've been plastered to the, my phone my Kindle and the computer um, watching everybody's vlogs just get I'm OCD huge I know some who else is like that I think Kathy Kathy's channel Kathy's journey shoot I can't remember I hate when that happens everybody does that I hate when you can't remember who it is Kathy who's having a really tough time right now there's quite a few Kathy's out there and she, she says the same thing. When her queue gets full like that, it kind of freaks me out. It's like I have to clean it up. I have to get in there and, and see what everybody's doing and then get to, down to zero. Um, and, of course, while you're in the process of doing it, there's people that are commenting and posting. And you can see on the side, oh, let's go see who's on right now. It's like, no, stop. So, anyway, I have probably about... 50 more vlogs to watch. I, I'm not, I like Marie and is it Sergio? The last time I watched Marie, Sergio wasn't even vlogging with her. I'm assuming that's her husband. And 
she's probably pounded out about 40 vlogs since then. And I know she hasn't been vlogging recently, so that just tells you that I kind of checked out in December and November. So I am almost there. I've got a few that I uh, that I really want to catch up on and a few that I'm not even sure if they're on rounds right now, but I'm going to peek my head in and say hello. Anyway, where am I at? Five minutes already. Crap. Oh, okay. The one thing I did want to say, and then I'm getting off before I get into a car accident. Um, I told Connie, I, uh, um, uh, free to be me HCG, that I would look up the jerky that I had eaten. I ate it two days in a row and still had losses. So this isn't for everybody because it has sugar in it and it, it some of you are gonna tisk tisk me um, for trying it. But because I travel so much and I'm not always in a situation where I know if I'm gonna have food or that my girls totally throw a monkey wrench in and change everything, um, I, I sometimes need items that are non-perishable that are protein and my go-to for that is macadamia nuts and I'm trying to really limit my macadamia nuts in this particular P2 round. I'm going to start eating them. I already know it. I always do. But right now I'm not yet. I'm not craving them. I'm not thinking about them. So I want to try this jerky. It's called Field Trip Jerky. You can get it at Costco right now or Amazon. Yes, jerky is expensive because it's a condensed form of protein and, and they have to do a lot to get, you know, a very small amount it requires a lot of attention. And if, of course, if you're buying the higher quality, it's even worse. So I think, let's see, $18.50, I got 16 servings. It was 100 calories for the serving that I was after. Five carbs, one fat, three sugars, and 14 grams of protein. No preservatives, no sodium nitrates, no added MSG, no high fructose corn syrup. Uh, ingredients, soy sauce, teriyaki, water, vinegar, ginger, garlic powder, onion powder, ginger powder, brown sugar, pineapple, hickory, liquid smoke, black pepper, and white pepper. So, as you can see, um, there are a few things in there. And it's not too bad for the most part, but there are just a couple of things in there that may give some of you trouble. So that's my check-in for today. I'm on my way to a soccer game and then a basketball game. I love all of you. Picking up my mother right now to take her with me to the games. Okay, everybody. Take care. Ciao. Bye.